Hey there. <clears throat> Coach Michael Burke. Saturday night. Man, I love Saturdays. I love Saturdays for a lot of reasons. Uh, one of the biggest reasons is because it allows me to spend time connecting with my family, connecting to my identity, uh, connecting to other thought leaders. Because I spend my Saturdays many times biking, uh, exercising. I've got a new trainer that's working out with me every day. So he came over and we boxed for 30 to 45 minutes. Man, was it a workout. Look at that. Sweating like crazy. But I spend Saturdays reconnecting to who I am as a person. And whatever craziness goes on in the week, it's very easy to get out of alignment with who you are and who you want to be. And many times we disempower our own selves and we allow another person's weakness to control us. We put our confidence in other people's hands. And that is a very dangerous thing to do. You hear me say, never allow another person to stand between you and your destiny. So how you spend the weekends is critical to reconnecting this month I'm on this concept of connection and I've been on this concept of connection because of my uh, good friend Dr. Kevin Elko who is a sports psychologist he's done some incredible work 27 time national championship you need to check him out Dr. Kevin Elko and he and I are doing some work together and he really his research found that championship teams have connection championship coaches have connection and I remember back in my early days of being a women's basketball coach how connected I was with my team five and a half hours a day I spent with my players leadership academy success academies training and then I comboed that with this weekend with the work of Anders Erickson who basically was the person who said after 10,000 hours of deliberate practice is when you master something. Now, a lot of people think just 10,000 hours. You could spend 10 years of doing something at a moderate pace and not become great at it. You need deliberate practice with the help of an expert who is correcting you. So like my buddy Brad Lee says, good training programs have great content, they have repetition, they have role play, and they have testing. Now, you tell me that's going on in corporate America today. It ain't going on. So when I think about connection, uh, Saturdays for me are about reconnection. I was watching a sermon this weekend, Jenston Franklin. He was talking about restoration. The word restoration has the word rest in it. So we live in a world of working hard. I get it. I probably work 80 to 90 hours a week doing what I love doing, coaching folks. But then I like restoration, resting. So Saturdays, I use to reconnect with me. What are my hopes? What are my dreams? What is my bigger future? What's my identity? Because when we align ourselves uh, with people that don't believe in our identities, then, then we get out of alignment. And when we get out of alignment, it's when we get ourselves into trouble. Okay, when you are clear, let me stop right here and make a good point about this. When you are clear about who you are and what you what you want to become, you begin attracting people back into your life. Because light gravitates toward light. Association breeds assimilation. We attract back who you are. So if you're an insecure person, you attract insecure people. So when you think about this, I want to encourage you today on Saturday, spend some time with yourself. Now, don't get me wrong, I spent time with my family. Uh, we just flew back in for being on basically a work vacation where we worked some, played some for seven days. Seven whole days we stayed at this place on Lake Norman, North Carolina. Little bitty town. Really is nothing to do there other than just hang out on the lake. But, but it was restorative for me. It was restorative. Big time people use their weekends to reconnect to who they are. 
to study and meditate on other people. All right, and because I was boxing, man, my arm's sore. And to refuel and restore for the week. Small time people use their weekends to escape, medicate. And I've certainly done that in my life. So, I want to encourage you. I'm talking connection all month. Thank you, Dr. Elko. I'm talking connection all of my classes starting on Monday in Knoxville. Monday afternoon in Chattanooga. Well, Tuesday at the Greatness Factory. Tuesday night at the Greatness Factory. Come on down and see old Coach Bird. Let me close with something Anders Erickson said. If you want to master something, it's not just 10,000 hours of practice, kids. It's 10,000 hours of deliberate practice with a coach who can correct you. So that's why so many people don't master it. Reconnect on the weekends who you are, who you want to attract. Never allow another person to stand between you and your destiny. I'm Coach Michael Burt. Follow me at Instagram, at Michael Burt. I'm writing articles on LinkedIn. Follow me on YouTube, at Michael Burt. Okay? And I'm excited. I'm excited about what's going to happen this month when we talk about connection. Because this is real. You lose connection, you lose engagement. You lose engagement, you lose momentum. You lose momentum, you ain't got nothing going for you, man. I believe everybody needs a coach in life. Thank you for letting me be yours.